Hi everybody, it's Nicole with Stargazer Luxuries and Stargazer Soaps. I am remaking a soap. This used to be known as Andromeda. If you followed along any, um, you have know, talked a bit about um, changing my business name and my logo and you know just the way I'm doing things. One of those things that have changed is I'm not naming my soaps after things in the sky anymore. I just found with all of the in-person shows that I do, it's too confusing for people. So I am naming soaps um, more along the lines of their fragrance description. This one is kind of a complex one. So the description is... Citrus notes of grapefruit, orange zest, tangerine, strawberries, apples, pears, rose petals, jasmine, vevitor, white musk, and lang lang. Um, this is kind of a cross between a fruit and a floral, but it's not heavy on either, if that makes sense. This is a very popular soap, one that sells out just almost as soon as I put it out. So, time to remake it. It's been a while. So do yellow, green, and purple. I was trying to catch that before it got to the bottom. And then the big batch is white. I'm soaping with the heat transfer method or thermal soaping. I know there are a few names for it. This is one of my favorite ways to soap, and I've been soaping this way for years. If I have time, I'll master batch, but lately I haven't had time. I am, you know, it, it takes almost a day to master batch, and I just don't have that kind of time in my life right now. So I'm just soaping as time allows. My second batch today, and I'm hoping I'll be able to get a few more batches done this week. Burn that up. I want this to be pretty white. That's not as white as I want it to be, but I don't want to add any more titanium dioxide. Oops. So I'm going to add some white mica. since I've soaked with this fragrance, but I, I remember correctly, it soaps pretty nicely. I don't remember a problem with acceleration or um, ricing or anything. Oh, it smells so good. This is one of my daughter's favorites. Um, for Christmas, this is what I made her, her soap and scrub out of. My girls get their very own soaps and something to go with every year for Christmas. And this last year they got um, a big loaf of soap and sugar scrub. This year they're telling me they want body butter too and lotion, so we'll see. I think last year they got body butter and lotion. Yep, this looks like it's doing okay. I thought maybe I saw some ricing, but I don't think so.
or I think it's just getting thick. But I'm going to just stick on this just to be on the safe side. swirl with this one usually. This will be the first time using this mold. Whoops. Probably should have done a little more color, but that's okay. is not. I figure usually it's the white that goes crazy. I think this is going to be my last pass of color. And then I'll save the rest for the top. This is not going to be the greatest of drop swirls. So I might go ahead and swirl this one. Let's see. Yeah, I think I will. Smack it down. Hopefully, that's okay. This one, I love to drop swirl. Um, I've never done anything but drop swirl this one. can be a good thing. Sometimes when during doing the thermal soaping, 
fragrances can it can accelerate fragrance a bit. I don't think I've had to work that fast in the past with this one. I'm just going to do some color on top. in the other room. If you can hear him, he's nowhere near. They don't come out here. But um, the walls in our living area and where my office is don't go to the ceiling. It's this great big open space. So I can still hear him and the kids. He uh, talks to his food. Uh, he will play with it. And well sit and howl and then attack it before he eats it. He'll knock a piece out of the bowl and then pounce on it and I don't know, it's he's he's a character. So if you can hear him, that's what he's currently doing. He's attacking his food. Tiny bit more purple. I love my molds now that I've finally figured them out. They're pretty great. I'm probably going to order more soon. So I really need to start ramping up production. Two loaves at one time is not really enough, and that's all I have right now. Um, I couldn't find my stick that I wanted. swirl this too much because I don't want to muddle it. I'd like the colors to stay defined. I have a little bit of glitter. And there you go. Don't go anywhere. I will have the cutting on the back half of this video. Okay, colors on this have really brightened up and it's really pretty today. It smells really good. This is one of my favorites. Um, I think I mentioned before this one used to be Andromeda. I've been thinking about the name well, since I made the soap yesterday and trying to decide how do I, what do I do? Do I keep the name Andromeda? The other one I was thinking of is um, Mardi Gras because I use Mardi Gras colors in this, so I might do that. one of the loaves. Okay. There's 
Just one end. That one's cool. Okay, swirl's okay. I really like the drop swirl on this one. That's my preference, but this came out nice too. Love the top. I love the colors of this one. This is one of my favorites. Sometimes remakes can get a little redundant. But um, I do like doing this one. And I do make this one a lot because it sells pretty quickly. But it has been a while. Okay, I'm going to add another loaf. This is one of the ends. this one up a little bit. If I do it right after I cut, it saves me a lot of time later. A little bit of an air pocket on that side, but if you catch them right after you cut, they're really easy to fill. Ta-da! pretty. Okay, I'm really happy with this one. I wasn't too optimistic. So, you know, you get your heart set on a certain design, which is why I really like to wing it. Okay, last one. But anyway, that's why I prefer to wing it, because if I don't have you know, a set plan, then it's just kind of a surprise. And that works for me. I like to fly by the seat of my pants. That's pretty. Those are the ends. I'll cut those up for samples. I do give out samples with orders. Alright, so this, I think, is going to be known as Mardi Gras, and this will be available on the website around the beginning of September 2016 at StargazerLuxuries.com. Thanks for watching.